Welcome to the St. James Assiniboia Power School Parent and Student Web Portal. This short video will assist you in getting connected to and using the portal. The Power School Portal is accessed by using a standard web browser, be it Internet Explorer, Firefox, or Safari, and it works on both Macs and PCs. The portal provides parents and students a secure and detailed view into attendance and assessment information. In early November, all parents of middle years or high school students will receive a brochure in the mail containing a unique access ID and password for each of their children. That code will allow a parent to attach their child to their PowerSchool account. Not only will parents have access to the portal, but so too will students. The student ID and password information is also provided in the brochure you will receive. To start the process, open up your web browser and connect to http colon slash slash ps.sjsd.net. That address will land you at the PowerSchool portal login page. If you already have created an account, simply enter your user ID and password and log into the system. If this is the first time visiting the PowerSchool portal, you'll need to create an account as a parent or guardian. Click the Create Account button to get started. The PowerSchool account creation page will appear. Begin by entering your first and last name, as well as your email address. Next, it's up to you to create a desired username. The username is the username you'll use to log into the system. You'll also need to create a password to go along with that username. Make it something easy enough to remember, but not easy enough to guess. In order to be able to view your child's attendance and assessment information, you'll need to tie them to your account. To do that, enter their name, the access ID and access password provided in the brochure, and indicate their relationship to you. If you have more than one child, you can continue entering the multiple students in this table. When you're complete, Click the Enter button. Now that your account is created, you're ready to log into the system. Enter your username and password and click Submit. Once you've logged into the system, your child's grades and attendance information will appear. If you've attached more than one child to your portal account, their names will appear across the top. Clicking the names will swap between the different children. This section here presents the past two-week summary of attendance. Keep in mind that at middle years, attendance is only recorded by home row. This section presents the courses and the current course grades. And this section presents the attendance information for the year to date. If you wish to send the teacher an email directly, Simply click on the teacher's name in the course list. Click the current grade to display a detailed view of the gradebook for that course. And clicking on the absences or tardies will display a detailed history attendance for that class. Of course, at middle years, that will only apply to the homeroom class. Let's click on the 78 for math and take a closer look at the gradebook. Taking a closer look at the gradebook for Math 7, you'll see all of the due dates and assignments that have been entered in the gradebook. If you click on a particular assignment in the assignment list, you'll be provided details regarding that assignment. This section displays special codes indicating whether the assignments were collected, late, missing, exempt, or whether the assignment is not included in the final grade. And here is the score. If the score is in blue and underlined, appearing as a link, Clicking that link will also display the comment that the teacher has attached to that particular grade. One thing to keep in mind when looking at the individual assignments in the teacher gradebook is that the final grade may be a result of special weighting used by the teacher when grouping those assignments. Now let's talk about some of the other icons across the top of your portal toolbar. Clicking the grade history icon will display the completed term grades for the student in the current school year. 
The attendance history icon will display a detailed daily breakdown of attendance for all classes for the current year. Keeping in mind that at middle years, attendance is only taken at homeroom. The email notification icon is one of the most attractive features of the parent portal. Using the email notification feature allows you to request automatic reports to be emailed you at selected intervals. Taking a closer look at the email notification screen, you'll notice that you can request an assortment of reports to be emailed to you on regular intervals, once a week, once every two weeks, once a month, or even daily. Those reports will be emailed to your registered email address tied to your portal account. You also have the option of directing those reports to other email addresses as well. You can apply these settings to all of your children or just to select children in your family. The school bulletin icon will display daily school announcements. The class registration icon is for student use and will be used later in the year for students to register for courses in the 2012-2013 school year. Clicking the account preferences icon allows you to manage all aspects of your PowerSchool portal account. Here you can change your name, your ID and password. The St. James Assiniboia School Division is proud to open its online PowerSchool portal to parents and students. The Parent Portal leverages the division's investment in its student information system by improving homeschool communication and giving parents immediate access to the information they need to ensure that their children are successful at school. If you have any further questions regarding the PowerSchool Portal, please don't hesitate to contact your school for further information.